head into the heat of the summer. The wet winter across the West has helped our grout. Taking a look at conditions tracked by the feds, parts of Clark County, the darker colors mean the more severe the drought. You could see we're abnormally dry or slight drought. We are not as severe as we was. Take a look. You remember two years ago, most of the Las Vegas Valley in extreme drought. Now all of these conditions affect our wildlife. The beloved desert tortoise is threatened. If the drought is severe, there's just not enough for them to eat. But if the desert is healthy, tortoises and the little ones have a fighting chance. Thanks to a good winter, many of these guys that are being tracked by federal scientists are making it in the wild. Perfect for its size. 94.41. From their height our scale to their weight, these little tortoises get the full body checkup. This one has been foraging recently. You can see sort of a green stain on its beak. To make sure they are eating well and surviving well in the great big desert. Scientists use trackers to find dozens of baby tortoises in this plot of desert north of the 15 and the 93. Fox 5 was there for the release in April last year. Scientists with five federal, state, and local agencies monitored their progress. It is tough for the tiniest and youngest creatures to make it on their own in the wild. Thanks to a good winter, many did. They are uh, growing uh, considerably. Um, we did receive uh, some good 2023-2024 winter rain, which has provided abundant uh, food source. You know, they're very susceptible to predation. Ravens have been out here, coyotes, and we'll go ahead and release them. Every month, the tortoises get a checkup when they are eating and drinking well and growing and building burrows. It's an indicator of the health of the desert. When tortoises eat, they also spread seeds, helping more flora grow throughout their habitat. If the drought's severe, the tortoises and desert ecosystem overall will suffer. We're at Coyote Springs. All that data is collected and meant for leaders to plan and take action towards conservation. So we can't just look at one year um, and say that's good enough to support the tortoise for many years to come. We are still within, you know, a long-term drought. They are a uh, keystone species out here. The burrows that they make are also home to, are used by other species out here. So it is a symbol of the West. Now, scientists with the U.S. Geological Survey say when you're out and about hiking this summer, here's how you can keep the tortoises safe. Watch out for things that look like rocks on the road. They might be a tortoise. If you park before you leave, check under your car and your tires. The tortoises are known to look for shade.